Archie's a little helicopter. He is brave, a little hero. Budgie and friends are always working hard together. Pip and Chuck and Lionel in a new adventure. Budgie! Rockety Rooters! Oh! Budgie's a little helicopter. He is nippy. Look at him go, it's Budgie. The little helicopter. Budgie was having a very strange dream about his friends at Harefield Airfield. The day before, Budgie and Pippa had rescued Ben and Lucy from a pair of crooks. But it had gone dark before Budgie could fly them home, and he'd come down for the night on what he thought was a station platform. Now he realised that he'd landed on a wagon. The train must have carried me here. And the twins. Oh, gosh. Where are the twins? Rocketing rotors. I... Oh, there they are. I knew it was, Lucy. It's Musselton. Musselton? Where's Musselton? Where Auntie Catherine used to live. Yeah. Well, that's not much help. Lucy. What? There's a telephone over there. We'd better let Mum know we're all right. I haven't got any money. I think I have. Yes. Oh, and a toffee. Oh, Ben, you can't eat that. No, suppose not. But I've got enough money for a phone call and a sandwich. Oh, right. Come on, then. Well, I can't stay on the train. It might be going somewhere else. Budgie to Lionel. Budgie to Lionel. Over. Lionel to Budgie. Hearing you loud and clear. Over. Lionel, I'm in a place called Musselton. But I don't know where that is. Yes, Budgie, we know. You know? How can you know? We've had a message from the controller. The twins just phoned Mrs Kitchen and told her. Yes, but that's another thing, Lionel. What's that? I've lost them again. The twins. They told their mother they'd wait on the beach. Oh, gosh, thank goodness. But I still can't fly them home. I don't know the way. It's all right. We've given Pippa the route. She'll fly out and lead you back. All right? Oh, great. I'm ready to go, Budgie. I'll see you soon. Super. Well, the tide's out, so I'll be on the beach too. Over and out. Hey, Lucy, look. What have you got? I found this bit of fishing line. It was tangled up in seaweed. Oh, and what's that? It's a bit of ham out of my sandwich. Oh, Ben, eat it properly. It's for bait. Oh. I'll tie it on the line. So we can fish for crabs. Yeah. Fantastic. Help! Get us down! I can't! The power's gone off! Gosh, they're stuck. I wonder if I could help. Pippa to Budgie, over. Hang on a bit, Pippa. I've got a job to do. See you on the beach, OK? OK. Take care. Over and out. Hey, it's a helicopter. It's getting too near. What does he think he's doing? Look out! What's he doing? Help! Yes, not too difficult. Now, carefully. Carefully. Got it. Now, push.
Nice work. Save the day, you did. Coming. Take it easy. Okay. Nearly there. Now! Yeah, another one. I'll put it in with the others. There. Right. Let's see if there's another. Yes. Hey, there's Budgie. They're sort of sailing boats with wheels, uh, sand jobs. Let's go and have a look. Right. Lionel to Pippa. Lionel to Pippa, over. Pippa to Lionel. Yes, Lionel? How long before you reach Musselton, Pippa? I'll be landing any minute now. I can see it ahead. Good show. Locate the twins and budget and radio back when you're leaving, all right? Will do, Lionel. Over and out. Ben? What? Leave it alone. I'm only looking. It's all right. He won't do any harm. Have a good look. Thanks. Great. Are you going to have a race? Well, we were, but there's no wind, so we've had it. Oh, dear. And once the tide's in, we can't race on the beach anyway, so... Hello. Another plane. We've already got a helicopter. That's Budgie. And that's Pippa. Hello, Pippa. Hello, Budgie. Can I land here? The beach is fine. Great to see you. Looks as though she's landing. Yes, she is. Whoa! Hey! That's the best wind we've had all week. I don't suppose. Right, Pippa. Ready to go. And don't forget to keep your brakes on. No. <laughs> it's working. Yeah. This is terrific. Here we go. Fantastic! Hey! <laughs> hey, what's with you people? What's so funny? Yes, if it hadn't been for, uh, uh... Pippa. Pippa, yes. We'd have had to cancel the race. And we only just managed it before the tide came in. Ah, the tide! Oh, no! My wheels are stuck. The sand's gone all soggy. I can't move. I know. Hang on. I'll let my cable down.
So you really did a first-class job, both of you. The twins are back with their mother, those two crooks are locked away, and I'm jolly proud of you. In fact... Say, Lionel! Yes, I haven't quite finished, Chuck. Oh, I guess you might as well. Might as well what? Finish! Now look here, Chuck. <laughs> I guess they're plumb tuckered out. Well, I never. Jolly good cheer, jolly, jolly good cheer. Budgie's a little helicopter He is brave, a little hero Budgie and friends are always working hard together Pip and Chuck and Lionel in a new adventure Budgie! Rocketing rotors! Oh! Budgie's a little helicopter He is nippy, look at him go, it's Budgie The little helicopter I bet the icebergs are fantastic. I had a friend who flew to Greenland, and she said it wasn't green at all. I guess I'll be doing all Thank the tough jobs. Maybe I could do some tobogganing on my skids. <clears throat> Sorry, Lionel. Yes. <clears throat> now, well, as you know, we are going on a scientific expedition to the Arctic. Oh, all that snow and ice. I will see the North Pole. Arctic? Huh. Back home, we have real cold Quiet. winters. Quiet! <clears throat> now. And we will be sailing... Sailing? Sailing, yes, on a cargo boat tomorrow. Tomorrow? A cargo boat? Wowee! Here, yeah, Don? Yeah? I hear that lot are going on a trip. Wish I was. They're going to the Arctic, near the North Pole. Oh. If there's one place I wouldn't like to go, it's the Arctic. Me too. <coughs> East, West, home's best, eh, Del? Dead right, Smokey. But you won't be on the boat, Pippa. Oh. Because you will be flying Professor Peterson to Iceland. Oh. He's the leader of the expedition. Jolly important. Gosh. All right? All right. So you go today, and we go tomorrow. Hooray! And tomorrow, for Budgie, was busier and earlier than anyone had thought. Budgie! Budgie! Huh? What? There's been a radio message from Professor Peterson. He needs a piece of scientific equipment from the cargo hold. OK! That's a job for me. I'm off to Iceland right now. No, Chuck, you're not. Aw, oh, come on, Captain. It's a small package and Budgie's a small helicopter. We need you here to lift the big stuff. Oh. Oh, yeah, OK. But you can take the little gizmo. Thank you, Chuck. Ken Wrench is getting it ready. Off in half an hour, all right? And look out for the weather, Budgie. The forecast isn't too hot. Not too hot. Whew, it's freezing. Good job it's not much further. Meedy, meedy. Gosh, what's that? The flower of Bambra to all ships and aircraft. Hello? Budgie to Flower of Bambra, over. We're a fishing boat in heavy seas. We're icing up, in danger of capsizing. Where are you? Over. About three miles north of Odin's Rock. Move away, then. Better get a move on. Budgie to Flower of Bambra, I can see you. Over. Oh, thank goodness. It's the ice. It's making us top heavy. Over. If I can get above it, maybe I can blow the ice off. Oh, great! 
It's working. It must be the heat from my engine. Show, Budgie. Well done. Yes, great. I was thinking of giving you the day off. Oh. But we've got it off anyway. <laughs> oh, have we? Mm, yeah, they're all getting the scientific bits and pieces ready. Not Professor Peterson. He's climbing up the volcano. Volcano? Yes. But it's not erupting or anything. It just smokes. Yes, very hot in the middle. Could we go and take a look at the island? Oh, yes. Could be, Lionel. Just for a bit. All right. Off you go. You've earned it. Pippa to Budgie. Pippa to Budgie. Over. Hello, Pippa. Over. Isn't this great? Fantastic. And I think I find the volcano. Where? Where? Just over the hills. Follow me. Great. Lead the way. Gosh, Pippa, it's like a giant's pudding base. <laughs> it's a very hot pudding. Yes. Red hot in the middle. <laughs> hey! What? There's someone on the edge of it. It's Professor Peterson. Oh, yes. Lionel said he'd be here. Ah! <gasps> he slipped. What? What's happened? The Professor. He's sliding into the volcano. Ah. Ah. He stopped. He's... I can hardly see him for the smoke, but I think he's managed to grab something. Oh, Budgie! I'm going down to get him. Budgie, you can't! It's too dangerous! Well, I can't just leave him. Don't worry. Over and out. Budgie! Budgie? Oh, no! Nice thing about Iceland. What? No heli wash. <laughs> oh, budgie. Hey, I'm going to take a look down there. Gosh, more smoke. No, steam. I wonder what it is. Steam? Oh, I know what it is, budgie. What? 
Be careful. It's a... Wash. Yep, that's the last. Well done. And just in time. It'll be nightfall soon. We should be able to see the northern lights. Northern lights? Mm, flickering colours in the sky, like an electric rainbow. Wonderful. And then, sleep. There'll be another tough day tomorrow. Yeah, I'm whacked. Right, Lionel. Yes, I'm pretty tired. Oh, and by the way, Budgie. Yes, Lionel? Congratulations. Oh, thanks. Uh, what for, Lionel? For looking so sparkling clean. Proud of you. <laughs> hmm? What did I say? What's so funny? Oh, <laughs> Pepper. Budgie's a little helicopter He is brave, a little hero Budgie and friends are always working hard together Pip and Chuck and Lionel in a new adventure Budgie! Rocketing rooters! Oh! Budgie's a little helicopter He is nippy, look at him go, it's Budgie The little helicopter aircraft from Harefield Airfield were working on a scientific expedition to the Arctic. Professor Peterson's team had set up camp on the edge of the Arctic Sea. Now the morning sun began to chase away the bitter cold of the night. Morning, Budgie. Chuck's still asleep. Uh-huh. Morning, Pip. Pippa? Has Pippa gone off already, Lionel? What? I didn't hear her take off. She didn't take off. No one's flown since we arrived. <sighs> hey, what gives? Have you seen Pippa? Well, uh, sure. Phew. She's right over the... Hey, where's she gone? That, Chuck, is what we'd all like to know. Oh. Gosh. So we have no idea where the plane is or the two mechanics. Ken Wrench and Mike come. Uh, Sprocket, yes. They were in a tent next to the aircraft. We think a slab of ice broke away in the night and drifted out to sea. Great Scott! I've organised a search. We'll just have to hope for the best. Oh, gosh! Where am I? What's happened? Now, oh, Mike, look where you're putting your feet. Hey, sorry, man. Hey, Ken, we're at sea. That was yesterday. Don't be silly. We are, man. How? Oh, too much. What are you on about? How can we be at... Good grief. So you, Chuck, will search to the east. Sure will, Lionel. And you, Budgie, to the west. Right. I'll coordinate the search and take care of the expedition. All right? Fine. All right. Off you go, and good luck.
Did you hear something then, Mike? Don't think so, man. No. Oh, thought it might be an engine. This is terrible. What am I going to do? <sighs> Mustn't panic. Got to keep calm. Punch to Pippa. Can you hear me? Over. Oh. Pippa to Budgie. Pippa to Budgie. Yes. Yes, I hear you. Wow. Where are you? I don't know, Budgie. Well, I'm on an ice floe, but everything looks the same. Well, don't worry. I'll find you. Over and out. I will find you. I will. Say what, man? I didn't speak. Someone did. Wasn't me. Whoa! Run for it! You're telling me? Well? Nah. Nothing. Ah, oh, gee. Budgie to Lionel. Budgie to Lionel. Over. Hey, the kid sounds excited. Shush. Lionel to Budgie. I hear you. There they are. I found them. I'm going down. Budgie. Budgie, you mustn't... He switched off. I'm gonna help him. You don't know where he is. I know he went west, and I can't just leave the little guy. Chuck! So long, Captain! Cure! That was close! <sighs> yeah, I've just about had it, man! If only there was something I could do! Look out! Here he comes again! To work, and if I can drag the ice floe to a big ice sheet, you'll have enough room to take off. Yes, I know it's a good idea, but it's the if that worries me. Wow! Go, man! Come on, Budgie! It's working, Budgie. No, it's just too heavy. I don't know what we can... Chuck to Budgie! Chuck to Pippa! Hey, what do you know? I found ya! Wow, Chuck, am I glad to see you! Okay, kid. Well, I better be getting back. The professor's got work for me to do. Okay. You go on ahead with Ken and Mike. You're faster than I am. I'll see you back at base. Sure you can find your way back. I found my way here. Sure. Okay. I'm out of here. What's that? Not another geezer. No. It's not. It's a whale. But what's it doing? Oh, no. That must be its baby, and the poor thing's stuck. Well, I'll have to try this job on my own. It's going! 
hands are all wet. Oh, that's great. Goodbye. Good luck. Oh, Another heavy wash. What a way to say thank you. I was having a whale of a time till then. Yes, seems he was held up by having to rescue a baby whale. Gosh, I was getting worried. He should be back any time now. Great. Uh, by the way, Chuck. Yes, sir, Captain, sir. Jolly well done. Gee, thanks, Captain. Lionel. Yes, Bippa? What's the professor doing? Hmm? Oh, the balloon. It carries scientific instruments miles up into the sky. Measures all sorts of things up there. Ah, there's the camp. Soon be home now. Hello. They're playing with the balloon. <laughs> oh, no. He's let go of the string. It's getting away. There it goes. And here comes Budgie. Oh, good. Yeah, jolly good. I... Hey, what's he up to? They'll be really upset if they lose that. It's a good job I was here. Now then, a little bit tricky, but... <coughs> he did what? There's no need to tell everyone. He brought their scientific balloon back before it had ever been away! Ha ha ha! I bet Lionel was pleased. I thought he was going to do what the balloon did. <coughs> What's that then? Burst! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Budgie, he was really proud of you. But it's nice to be home. We've had enough of the Arctic. Oh, well, that's a pity. A pity? Why? It's starting to snow. Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> is a little helicopter Brave a little hero. Budgie and friends are always working hard together. Pip and Chuck and Lionel in a new adventure. Budgie! Rocketing roses! Oh! Budgie's a little helicopter. He is nippy. Look at him go with Budgie. The little helicopter. It was the autumn holidays. For once, there was a whole week without any work to be done. And the people who worked at Harefield Airfield were all very happily going away. But Lionel <coughs> hated not being busy. Jack looked around for something to do. And even Budgie was beginning to think that a whole week of not having to get up in the morning might be a mm. bit too much of a good thing. But all at once, Hello, what's that? Hello? It's Farmer Hayes' tractor. Hello? Line up! I need help! What's the problem, Ernest? It's Farmer Hayes. Can I have a word? I'm afraid the doors are closed, Ernest. They've all gone away. I think I can open the doors, Lionel. What? How? Watch this. Hello? Hang on, Ernest. Pippa's trying something. Oh, Pippa, brilliant! Well done, Pippa! It's Farmer Eyes! What's the problem? Took him to hospital, they are! Poor man! It's not him! It's the farm! How do you mean? It's harvest time! The barley needs mowing! The sheep have to be dipped! The cows need bringing in! Oh, dear! I can't do it all myself! I need help! Then I've only one thing to say! Yes, Lionel? Shock! Away! Hello, Budgie. Hi. I'm going to spread chalk on Farmer Hayes' meadow. Oh, good. It's 
something the matter, Budgie? Look what Ernest got me carrying. Pig swill. Oh, oh dear. Uh, oh dear. I think I'd better go. Lucky for some. Cute joysticks. What's got into Chuck? whoop a tie -a yay Get along, little doggies. It's your misfortune and none of my own. whoop a tie -a yay Get along. Oh, hi, Captain. What's all the racket? Racket? It's my cowboy song. I'm a cowpoke. Well, try being a quiet cowpoke, Chuck, or you'll turn the milk sour. <laughs> ah, shucks. <laughs> Ernest? <laughs> you look as if you've seen a ghost. Well, actually, you look as if you are a ghost. <laughs> oh, very good. <laughs> <laughs> Lionel to Budgie, over. Come in, Lionel. I wonder if you could give me a hand with these sheep, Budgie. They're jolly difficult to keep on course. Be with you in no time, Lionel. Over and out. Shoo, you silly creature. Shoo! Not that way, thanks. God, what's the matter with the thing? No! Judd, hurry! Short instincts! OK, Lionel, I'm here. Too late, Budgie. It's gone over the cliff. Oh, no. Wait a minute. It's all right, Lionel, but it's stuck on a ledge. Judd, hurry! Short instincts! How do we get the poor creature out of this? I think I've got an idea, Lionel. Back in a minute. By Jove, Budgie, I just hope this works. Uh, Will it jump into the crate? Uh, uh, By Jove, Budgie, you've done it. Jolly good show. But I still don't understand why it jumped in. Well, <laughs> there was a load of parsnips in there. So, if you ever go fishing for sheep again, you know what bait to use. <laughs> well, you certainly did a good job rounding up the rest of those sheep, Chuck. Ah, oh, gee, it was nothing. The only trouble is... What? You put them into the pig pens. Oh, no. Which is where you put the cows before. Ah, oh, gee. It's like Noah's Ark in there. Gee, I'm sorry. It's all right. I'll get the cows out and give them a drink. You all right to fill them troughs? Tank's full and ready for action. <coughs> Stand by. Well, they surely ain't going to fill them from there. Of course I am. <coughs> I'm a fire engine, <coughs> not a garden spray. Watch this. <coughs> oh, no. <coughs> I must have got my angles wrong. Thank you, Smokey. <laughs> Very much. Cheer up, Ernest. Looks like it did you good. Oh, yes? Well, you sure have got your color back. Jolly good show, Budgie. You did a good job. And you, Lionel. Anyway, I think that's it. I jolly well hope so. I'm worn out. Hmm. I think my engine's getting a bit hot. Ah, got it. I'll see you back there. Oh, 
Oh, fiddle de dee. Budgie isn't the only one who's overheating. Overheating? By Jove, yes, I must have. Juddering joysticks, it's not me, it's the field. And I can't get started. Hi, kiddo. Finished? Yes, we've built a super haystack. Anyway, Lionel will be here in a minute and then we can... <gasps> what is it? Smoke! Look! There's a fire! It's the hayfield! And where is Lionel? Oh, gosh. Come on. Fires, go, go, go. Oh no, what is it? What's the matter? I'm out of water. <coughs> the cows have had the lot. There isn't time to fill up again. Ah, oh, gee, this is it. So long, Captain. No, what the pigs will bucket. Poor little guy, he's delirious. No use. Oh, jolly bad show. Jolly, jolly bad show. Chuck, look, there's Budgie. <laughs> He's coming back. What's he doing? He's crazy. Budgie, Budgie, get out of it. Leave me here. Save yourself. <laughs> Two ways about it, kiddo. You were stupendous. You were, Budgie. Stupendous. Oh, well. Saved my life, Budgie. I'd never be able to thank you. It was. It was a jolly good show. I seen you looking smarter, mind. <laughs> I don't think duckweed's your color. <laughs> Mm. Well, I suppose we ought to be getting back to the hangar. Oh, couldn't we just have a little bit of a rest first, Lionel? Mm. Yes, it's been a really hard day. Good idea. Uh, just for ten minutes. All right? Overheating? By Jove, yes, I must have... Juddering joysticks, it's not me, it's the field. And I can't get started. Hi, kiddo. Finished? Yes, we've built a super haystack. Anyway, Lionel will be here in a minute and then we can... <gasps> what is it? Smoke! Look! There's a fire! It's the hayfield. And where is Lionel? Oh, gosh. Come on. Don't worry. I've got it. <laughs> Fighting fires. Go, go, go. Oh, no. What is it? What's the matter? I'm out of water. <coughs> the cows have had the lot. There isn't time to fill up again. Ah, oh, gee, this is it. So long, Captain. No. What? The pigs will bucket. 
Poor little guy. He's delirious. No use. Oh, jolly bad show. Jolly, jolly bad show. Chuck, look! There's Budgie! <laughs> Budgie, get out of it! Leave me here! Save yourself! <laughs> no two ways about it, kiddo! You were stupendous! You were, Budgie. Stupendous! Oh, well. Save my life, Budgie. I'd never be able to thank you. It was... it was a jolly good show. I seen you looking smarter, mind. Mm. I don't think duckweed's your colour. <laughs> mm. Well, I suppose we ought to be getting back to the hangar. Oh, couldn't we just have a little bit of a rest first, Lionel? Yes, it's been a really hard day. Good idea. Uh, just for ten minutes. All right? Already got a helicopter. That's Budgie. And that's Pippa. Hello, Pippa. Hello, Budgie. Can I land here? The beach is fine. Great to see you. As though she's landing. Yes, she is. Whoa! Hey! That's the best wind we've had all week. Yeah, I don't suppose. Right, Pippa. Ready to go. And don't forget to keep your brakes on. No. <laughs> it's working! Yeah! This is terrific! Here we go! Yes, if it hadn't been for, uh, uh... Pippa. Pippa, yes. We'd have had to cancel the race. And we only just managed it before the tide came in. Ah, the tide! Oh, no! My wheels are stuck. The sand's gone all soggy. I can't move! I know. Hang on. I'll let my cable down.
jolly good show, Mudgy. You did a good job. And you, Lionel. Anyway, I think that's it. I jolly well hope so. I'm worn out. Hmm. I think my engine's getting a bit hot. Ah, got it. I'll see you back there. Oh, fiddle de dee. Budgie isn't the only one who's overheating. Overheating? By Jove, yes, I must have... Juddering joysticks, it's not me, it's the field. And I can't get started. Hi, kiddo. Finished? Yes, we've built a super haystack. Anyway, Lionel will be here in a minute and then we can... <gasps> what is it? Smoke! Look! There's a fire! It's the hayfield. And where is Lionel? Oh, gosh. Come on. Don't worry. I've got it. Fighting fires. Go, go, go. Oh, no. What is it? What's the matter? I'm out of water. <coughs> the cows have had the lot. There isn't time to fill up again. Ah, oh, gee. This is it. So long, Jeff. No. What? The pig's will bucket. Poor little guy. He's delirious. No use. Oh, jolly bad show. Jolly, jolly bad show. Chuck, look! There's Budgie! <laughs> He's coming back! What's he doing? He's crazy! Budgie! Budgie, get out of it! Leave me here! Save yourself! <laughs> Two ways about it, kiddo. You were stupid. Hey. <laughs> hey, what's with you people? What's so funny? Yes, if it hadn't been for, uh, uh... Pippa. Pippa, yes. We'd have had to cancel the race. And we only just managed it before the tide came in. Ah, the tide! Oh, no! My wheels are stuck. The sand's gone all soggy. I can't move. I know. Hang on. I'll let my cable down. of you. The twins are back with their mother, those two crooks are locked away, and I'm jolly proud of you. In fact... Say, Lionel! Yes, I haven't quite finished, Chuck. Oh, I guess you might as well. Might as well what? Finish! Now look here, Chuck. Whew. 
<laughs> I guess they're plum tuckered out. Well, I never. Jolly good chair, jolly, jolly good chair. She's a little helicopter. Yes, it seems he was held up by having to rescue a baby whale. Gosh, I was getting worried. He should be back any time now. Great. Uh, by the way, Chuck. Yes, sir, Captain, sir. Jolly well done. Gee, thanks, Captain. Lionel. Yes, Pippa. What's the professor doing? Hmm? Oh, the balloon. It carries scientific instruments miles up into the sky. Measures all sorts of things up there. Ah, there's the camp. Soon be home now. Hello. They're playing with a balloon. Oh, no! He's let go of the string. It's getting away. There it goes. And here comes Budgie! Oh, good show. Jolly good show. I... Hey, what's he up to? They'll be really upset if they lose that. It's a good job I was here. Now then, a little bit tricky, but... <coughs> he did what? There's no need to tell everyone. He brought their scientific balloon back before it had ever been away! Ha ha ha! Cool! I bet Lionel was pleased. I thought he was going to do what the balloon did. <coughs> What's that then? Burst! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Budgie, he was really proud of you. But it's nice to be home. We've had enough of the Arctic. Oh, well, that's a pity. A pity? Why? It's starting to snow! Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> is a little helicopter He is brave, a little Budgie and friends are always working hard together. Pip and Chuck and Lionel in a new adventure. Budgie! Rocketing roses! Oh! Budgie's a little helicopter. He is nippy. Look at him go with Budgie. The little helicopter. It was the autumn holidays. For once, there was a whole week without any work to be done. And the people who worked at Harefield Air... My wheels are stuck. The sand's gone all soggy. I can't move. I know. Hang on. I'll let my cable down. both of you. The twins are back with their mother, those two crooks are locked away, and I'm jolly proud of you. In fact... Say, Lionel! Yes, I haven't quite finished, Chuck. Oh, I guess you might as well. Might as well what? Finish! Now look here, Chuck. Hmm. 
<laughs> I guess they're plum tuckered out. Well, I never. Jolly good chair, jolly, jolly good chair. Budgie's a little helicopter He is brave, a little hero Budgie and friends are always working hard together Pip and Chuck and Lionel in a new adventure Budgie! Rockety Rooties! Oh! Budgie's a little helicopter He is nippy, look at him go, it's Budgie The little helicopter I bet the icebergs are fantastic. I had a friend who flew to Greenland, and she said it wasn't green at all. I guess I'll be doing all the cup jobs. Maybe I could do some tobogganing on my skids. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Lionel. Yes. <clears throat> now, well, as you know, we are going on a scientific expedition to the Arctic. Oh, all that snow I and ice. I wonder if we'll see the North Pole. Arctic? Huh. Gee, you're welcome, kiddo. Have a good day. Yes, thanks, Chuck. We'd never have managed without you. Ah, that's okay, kid. Well, I'd better be getting back. The professor's got work for me to do. Okay. You go on ahead with Ken and Mike. You're faster than I am. I'll see you back at base. Sure you can find your way back? I found my way here. Sure. Okay, I'm out of here. What's that? Not another geezer. No, it's not. It's a whale. But what's it doing? Oh, no. That must be its baby. And the poor thing's stuck. Well, I'll have to try this job on my own. having to rescue a baby whale. Gosh, I was getting worried. He should be back any time now. Great. Uh, by the way, Chuck. Yes, sir, Captain Sir. Jolly well done. Gee, thanks, Captain. Lionel. Yes, Pippa. What's the professor doing? Hmm? Oh, the balloon. It carries scientific instruments miles up into the sky. Measures all sorts of things up there. There's the camp. Soon be home now. Hello. They're playing with a balloon. Oh no! He's let go of the string. It's getting away. There it goes. And here comes Budgie. Oh good. Yeah, jolly good. I. Hey, what's he up to? They'll be really upset if they lose that. It's a good job I was here. Now then, a little bit tricky, but. What? There's no need to tell everyone. Let's see. That was yesterday. Don't be silly. We are, man. How? Oh, too much. What are you on about? How can we be... Good grief. So you, Chuck, will search to the east. Sure will, Lionel. And you, Budgie, to the west. Right. I'll coordinate the search and take care of the expedition. 
All right? Fine. All right. Off you go, and good luck. Did you hear something then, Mike? Don't think so, man. Oh, thought it might be an engine. Oh dear, this is terrible. What am I going to do? <sighs> Mustn't panic. Got to keep calm. Bunch to Pippa. Can you hear me? Over. Oh, Pippa to Budgie. Pippa to Budgie. Yes. Yes, I hear you. Wow. Where are you? I don't know, Budgie. Well, I'm on an ice floe, but everything looks the same. Well, don't worry. I'll find you. Over and out. I will find you. I will. Say what, man? I didn't speak. Someone did. Wasn't me. Sounds excited. Shush. Lyle to Budgie. I hear you. There they are. I found them. I'm going down. Budgie. Budgie, you mustn't. He switched off. I'm going to help him. You don't know where he is. I know he went west, and I can't just leave the little guy. But Chuck. So long. Close. <sighs> yeah, I've just about had it, man. If only there was something I could do. Look out! Here he comes again! <laughs> Oof. Oh, man! Oh. Cord and a sandwich. Oh, right. Come on, then. Well, I can't stay on the train. It might be going somewhere else. Budgie to Lionel. Budgie to Lionel. Over. Lionel to Budgie. Hearing you loud and clear. Over. Lionel, I'm in a place called Musselton. But I don't know where that is. Yes, Budgie, we know. You know? How can you know? We've had a message from the controller. The twins just phoned Mrs. Kitchen and told her. Yes, but that's another thing, Lionel. What's that? I've lost them again. The twins. They told their mother they'd wait on the beach. Oh, gosh. Thank goodness. But I still can't fly them home. I don't know the way. It's all right. We've given Pippa the route. She'll fly out and lead you back. All right? Oh, great. I'm ready to go, Budgie. I'll see you soon. Super. Well, the tide's out, so I'll be on the beach, too. Over and out. Hey, Lucy, look. What have you got? I found this bit of fishing line. It was tangled up in seaweed. Oh, and what's that? It's a bit of ham out of my sandwich. Oh, Ben, eat it properly. It's for bait. Oh. I'll tie it on the line. So we can fish for crabs. Yeah. Fantastic.
Swan, me! He's done it! Yay! Great! Now then, I... Oh, gosh, help! Whoa! And even Budgie was beginning to think that a whole week of not having to get up in the morning might be a mm. bit too much of a good thing. But all at once... Hello, what's that? Hello? It's Farmer Hayes' tractor. Hello? Line up! I need help! What's the problem, Ernest? It's Farmer Hayes. Can I have a word? I'm afraid the doors are closed, Ernest. They've all gone away. I think I can open the doors, Lionel. What? How? Watch this. Hello? Hang on, Ernest. Pippa's trying something. God, Pippa, brilliant. Well done, Pippa. It's Farmer Ice. What's the problem? Took him to hospital, they are. Poor man. It's not him. It's the farm. How do you mean? It's harvest time. The barley needs mowing. The sheep have to be dipped. The cows need bringing in. Oh, dear. I can't do it all myself. I need help. Then I've only one thing to say. Yes, Lionel? Shocks away! Hello, Budgie. Hi. I'm going to spread chalk on Farmer Hayes' meadow. Oh, good. Is something the matter, Budgie? Look what Ernest's got me carrying. Pig swill. Oh, oh dear. Uh, oh dear. I think I'd better go. Hmm. Lucky for some. Head on joysticks. What's got into Chuck? Whoop a tie, yeah, yay. Get along, little doggies. It's your misfortune and none of my own. Whoop a tie, yeah. yay. Get along. Oh, hi, Captain. What's all the racket? Racket? It's my cowboy song. I'm a cowpoke. Well, try being a quiet cowpoke, Chuck, or you'll turn the milks off. <laughs> ah, shucks. <laughs> Ernest! <laughs> you look as if you've seen a ghost. Well, actually, you look as if you are a ghost. <laughs> oh, very good. <laughs> I wonder if you could give me a hand with these sheep, Budgie. They're jolly difficult to keep on course. 